Hi everyone, so I am back with my new tutorial again. In this I am going to create a selling fan and also show you how to animate it and render it. So please watch this video till the end and thanks. So at first move on to general. Now delete this three camera cube and this light just select this hole and press delete key from your keyboard. Now go to add mesh then select a cylinder from here and after selecting go over here at the left side corner and you can see add cylinder click on that and keep its vertices on 12 like this. Now press 1 for front view and press tab key from your keyboard for moving on editing mode and now press shift z for uh, bringing the wireframe. Now after that Keep this over here now press s for scaling it so we are making the body of our fan so let's begin with that go over here uh, click on loop cut tool and keep one loop cut over here and one here and one here just select this and select this and press s like that now select this part now again press s now again take some loop cuts over here one over here and one over here after we have done now just select this and this one and then again press s like this so after that then select this part this part also press ctrl b for bubbling it just adding the curveness uh, for our model like this now after that you can see now again press 1 for front view selection and after that just I will uh, make several changes into its shape if you uh, require you can also make another design as per your choice and then just uh, scale it down add z axis like this now after that you can see we have made it till here now let's add some loop cuts over here for making these edges sharp if we subdivide it just add some here and one here also now after adding add uh, here also and over here also so after that press 3 for face selection and select this upper face then press E and S scaling that part and repeat that for down part also press E then press S like this so after that we have made our fans basic shape so I am not moving on much detail for my fan model because this is tutorial for beginners I am just showing you the simplest way for creating a selling fan if you require you can also take reference from Google and you can make your own model by your own thinking or your own choice. So after this press type key for moving on object mode again now right click and then smooth shade. Now after smooth shading press ctrl 1. So you can see our model is smooth enough and you can see uh, we have added a loop cut tool over here so how uh, sharp it is looking so after completing this part now let's move further so for that just select this model now press tab again and for a while I will hide this subdivision mode for a while now just select this part upper part now press shift D for duplicating it now press S for scaling that duplicated part so now keep this over here now right click then go to separate then select selection so after we have separated that part press tab and press on that object which we have separated and go to object set origin origin to geometry if you do like this our cursor will be got directly attached to our main object which we are creating like this now press tab key now press a for selecting it whole now press E like this 
then press S like this. So this is a simple shape which I wanted to give at the top of my fan, selling fan. Now select this uh, inner part and then delete it like this. So after deleting again select this, now press E and S. Just make uh, it till here like this. Again S like this. Now press E again and move it on Z axis like this. So you can see we have made a basic shape. Now press Shift D again for duplicating it. Now press S for scaling it like this. Now again separate it selection. And then press Tab again select this part object set original original geometry. We will um, work on this part later on. First we will complete with this part which we have made. Now again press Tab from your keyboard. Now select this part above face and then just delete it. Delete the faces like this. After deleting it, just move on to front view and just adjust it till you are satisfied like this. Press S again. Now keep this over here. Now after this, let's add some loop cuts. Uh, one here and one over here and one here for bringing the sharpness like this so after that you can see now select this part select one vertex, vertex and then press alt and select another so you will notice the whole vertices has been selected now press e and s for inserting it like this just insert it now again add some loop cut over here for making it sharper like this after that press tab so you can see now keep it downwards to our selling fan attach that now after we have finished with this part so let's make its upper part so for that just bring our object which we have hidden it previously now click on it now press tab key from your keyboard simply just keep this over here now press s now press e for extruding it like this Extrude it as per your choice. Now press A for selecting it whole. Just keep it little up and then just delete its down face from here and from here also. Now after we have deleted it, just adjust it properly and then just keep it over here. Now after this, let's make its upper part again. It's a, it is a rod of our selling fan. Now let's make the upper part. For that, just press 7 from your keyboard for moving on top view. Then press E, then press S. After pressing, just scale it like this. After you have scaled it, again press S if you want to make it a little more bigger like this now press e and z for extruding it in z axis like this so it seemed to be smaller just press uh, select these parts after selecting just press s for scaling and then just keep it over here now let's make this part little curved press Ctrl B for bevelling and then just drag your mouse and if you scroll your mouse you will see the levels I um, mean see the loop cuts over here like this so I will add two or three uh, how much it is now after that just uh, select this hole now press F for filling it now press E and S just for adding some loop cuts over here so after it is done, now add one loop cut over here also, two loop cuts, one here and one over here. So our basic parts are done. Now you can see our selling fans body is done. Now let's make its wing part. So for the wing, go to add mesh, then select a cube. After we have selected a cube, press 7 for topmost view. And then press tab key from a keyboard. Now press shift Z for wireframe and then just keep it over here. And 
like this now add some loop cuts tool over here one here and one over here uh, this much select this also and then just keep it over here and after that press 3 for side view and then just adjust its height length and press 3 then press E from your keyboard for extruding it like this so this is the wing of our fan now delete this part press delete key from your keyboard and delete this part now press 2 for edge selection and select these four edges uh, corner edges as you can see one here one here one here like this now press ctrl b for bevelling it so you can see notice the detail like this now again press 7 now press 1 from your keyboard now shift z now just scale it on x axis like this or y axis you can see you can see just scale it a little for adding some depth like this after we have scaled it now add some loop cuts uh, keep one loop cut over here and one for down and one for here now press 3 from your keyboard now select this 3 press E and S now for down also do the same E and S and press S so we have completed with the wing part of our fans model now simply go to uh, object now go to set origin then select origin to geometry like this now press 7 from your keyboard just press S for scaling it and tab key I wanted to make it little longer like this uh, so here all done now press shift Z for getting out of that wireframe now keep this over here just attach it like this now let's make it swing now press 7 now after that uh, go to add modifier and click on mirror now after you have clicked on mirror select this mirror object and then just you can uh, click on the main object like this over here now from here go to apply after you have applied again go to object set origin select on origin to geometry now press shift d for duplicating that now click over here and then just press r and here you can give it minus 90 degree so here our fans model modeling part is done now if you want to make several changes into that you can also make it uh, i will make it a little short like this so after that you can see our final uh, model is done so we have completed with our modeling part now let's move on to coloring part so first of all select these wings and press ctrl 1 and smooth shade it like this and for this also it is already we have already smooth shaded that like this now go to your shading option now let's give it a nice color and yes don't forget to group these now press these four wings now press ctrl j from your keyboard for grouping that those and after we have grouped it go over here take a new material and give it a nice color i will give it a brown color dark brown color like this and now go over here uh, copy that hex ctrl c for copying it and paste it on this uh, middle part center part ctrl v like this now just decrease its roughness from here for wings also now after this like this part new then just i will give it a black color you can choice your own color as you require 
after that let's select this rod part new then i will give it a gray color and decrease its roughness increases its metallic part like this so after that we have finished with our modeling and coloring part now let's move on for its animation part so this part is gonna be interesting for you so let's animate our fan just i will rotate it around and round so for that just select its wing part and select this center part and also this black uh, uh, part also now press ctrl j for grouping these then go to object set origin origin geometry so after that just drag our timeline over here now press I from your keyboard now select this rotation so you can see one keyframe is added over here now on this auto key now after that press 7 for top view now keep this over 50 and press R then 360 degree now press enter from your keyboard now go over here clear uh, right 50 frames like it will end on 50 frame and start from one frame so if you press and give this down and if you press space bar you can see we have easily modeled and animated our fan so this is all in today's video if you want to render it just go over here on render view and just you can give it spy ground color like or this in white color or you can render it in no time and you can just so i hope you uh, like this tutorial and i'm sure it must be useful for you so that's it for today we have uh, modeled and colored then uh, this animated our fan model so thanks for watching and please don't forget to like comment and subscribe till then bye take care